Hey there guys, it's Zach here from InBeta and welcome back to another video. Now today we're taking a look at Windows 10 build 10537. This build is uh, an unofficial build that includes a number of features and enhancements over the last public preview build which was 10532. So diving straight in, the first noteworthy changes are with modern apps or more specifically the way you can open and close them. So in the Windows 10 RTM opening and closing a modern app would leave you with no animation at all. Uh, whereas Win32 apps such as File Explorer here when opened uh, actually opens with a nicer fade effect there and when closed gives you a nice fade effect when closing as well. Now in this build, build 10537, closing modern apps has the same animation. So if I close uh, mail here, there it closed just like the Win32 apps do. And that's great. This is Microsoft finally uh, finalizing the UI properly, just making everything the same across all the different things. So uh, why should a modern UI or sorry, store apps be treated differently when it comes to animations? They shouldn't. So Microsoft is addressing that in this build. Another change is grade context menu, slightly grey. Uh, in the RTM or in the previous uh, public build, the context menus are white and many people are complaining about this and Microsoft has slightly dimmed them as you can see here. They are now slightly dimmed, uh, not dramatically and I'd much rather them just use the uh, dark context menu found here. But oh well, I guess um, they're doing something and hopefully in the end we will have a light dark mode anyway so we can switch between the two. Now finally, the last changes are with the dev uh, with icons. So if we go into the device manager here, you will see that uh, on this side, we've got a number of new, I mean, they're a bit hard to see, but also my, my trackpad has uh, grabbed hold of this window. There we go. So if we make that full screen, no, full screen. No, apparently it doesn't go full screen. Um, okay, well, let's try that again, device manager. Full screen, there you go. So as you can see here, a number of these icons have been updated. And if we go into, is it printers? Devices and printers, you will see here that uh, there are also new icons here as well. So these down here, they don't display in the previous build or in the RTM, but they do now, which is pretty great. So Microsoft again is finalizing the UI, making, or say finalizing, working on the UI, touching the UI, to, uh, touching up the UI to uh, make it more professional and more synergized across uh, user experiences. So there you have it guys, that's pretty much it for this build. Actually, I think Microsoft Wi-Fi Sense is, on, is here by default. So let's go down to Microsoft Wi-Fi. Yes, as you can see here, Microsoft Wi-Fi is, in, is built into this, um, this build, but unless you're in an area which it supports, it doesn't actually work. So there you have it guys, that's a quick look at Windows 10 build 10,537. Thanks so much for watching and I shall see you in the next one. Bye bye.